Well, Martin, over here. Uh, first of all, congratulations on the victory. You've now given Alexander Romanov his first professional loss of his career. So I'm curious, what are the emotions after a hard-fought win like that? Uh, you know, I didn't. That, no, that was nothing. Something I was seeking for to, you know, to go to, you know, get his first loss. I think he's a tough opponent, and he's still like uh, his his hype is still there. And I think he's getting to the top, and uh, it's like I always, I also get, getting to the top. So we just clash a little bit sooner than than we're supposed to. And yeah, he's still, he's still uh, he's still there. And my emotion, like you know. Uh, more crazy about you know suffer so much in the, in the first round and and be able to come back in a second. I was going to ask about that. The first round he had a very strong showing, and then it seems like his cardio started maybe to fail him, and then you kind of took over. Do you think that's just your you've you've been fighting for so long, you know how to maintain your cardio in these high level fights? Maybe he just doesn't. Uh, you know, it's not like uh, some that's not something I'm planning. It's like. Really hard for me to give up, and and, and that is it. That's why my my cardio is is uh, you know se seems to be so good. And I didn't plan in this fight to you know to have a guy on my back for the whole round. So, and you know as long as we see that he was still there and he was you no know, getting excited, I know he's getting tired. And you know it's. I didn't, you know, all, all this wasn't wasn't the plan. I rather be a guy who wrestled with those te top wrestlers. But I think this guy wrestled for a long time and he was strong. I, I could feel that. So I'm uh, quite happy that I survived there. When you heard one judge scored at 20 28, what were your thoughts? Did you think you had done enough to get the decision like that? I wasn't so sure. I wasn't. I, I, it's like I nev I'm never. 100% sure when the fights end. I never argue about you know close fight that I supposed to win even though I'm lo lost. I rather I'm rather the guy who goes there and try to get the finish. So when the fights end, I I was just patiently waiting for the for the decision. And this city, Salt Lake, has very high altitude in a lot of fighters. Like, you know, the last fight before yours, it seems Leandro Santos got tired. Did, did the altitude affect you at all in there? I don't know. I mean, uh, it depends. Uh, maybe, but you know, uh, it's, it was my first time with Alexander Romanov, so <laughs> we're supposed to fight one more time in, in different place, and that, uh, I don't know. But yeah, I s actually came to uh, US like uh, three weeks ago to adjust. We spent lots of time in the mountains to prepare. Come here early. Also, did a couple of trainings here, so I think. I adjusted well enough for this altitude. And then finally, uh, when do you want to get back in there and what would you like the rest of your year to look like in the UFC? Uh, you know, the last fight wasn't so lucky for me. I mean, the one I got pulled off short notice and I was go I was like uh, more humble for this one, try to focus on uh, on what to do and I didn't think about it, didn't, you know, search for names and, you know, now where the fight is end, I uh, will start to moving on, but I don't have anyone or, or or the date as soon as possible, I guess. Martin, congrats on the win. A lot of back and forth, a lot of ebb and flow. What surprised you about your opponent? Because you had to make a couple of adjustments in those fifteen minutes. Uh, you know, I, as I'm as I'm saying, he's a great guy. He's a great fighter. He's uh, he's a he's a, for sure he's a top five. Fighter and he will be getting there because you know uh, he proved it 16 and 0. It's now it's 16 and 1, but 16 and 0 is is big thing in a, in a MMA in a heavyweight division. I don't think there is a lot of guys who who achieve that in a heavyweight division. I don't know any. So yeah, the you know in this I, I can feel his power, his natural power in this fight. He's very strong. And you know he didn't give up either, and I was trying to give him some opportunities in the second, in the, th in the third round. Excellent. And you did seem, you know, you were focused and you seemed patient. What of the game plan were you able to implement, and what other stuff did you have to adjust in there? Uh, I was try. My game plan was to not uh, let him take me down, and and I would strike him, and you know. I always say the plan is a plan. Uh, you have to go and brawl. Uh, <laughs> I did, and you know I'm I'm more known of the cardio than of my natural power. So you know, even though he took me down in the first round, I wasn't like I uh, you know already disappointed so much. I I knew I have to you know stay there, concentrate and and adjust in a second. Congrats, sir. That was a great performance. Well done. Thank you.
Thank you.